This conference will now be recorded. Yeah, once again, welcome back all again after a few days. Okay, so today we're going to discuss about the topic called support pack upgrade, a patch upgrade, a support pack upgrade. Everything is same. Okay, what we need in this, we need only one transaction called spam, which was used earlier, like today also we're using. But previously, when we started learning SAP basis and all, at that time we have only one T code spam to do the patch upgrade, and there is no other way. But today we have few tools available in SAP by which also we can do the update. But today also people are believing this because this is a hardcore. This is if you do with this, no error will come, and it is very fast and easy. But if you take a new process, which takes some more of a time, if anything goes wrong, if the whole system goes into vain, again you have to restore. But here we can go back, we can come back. There is a step by till till that time we can come back anytime if you use spam. But some we have one more to call some S U M. So with the sum tool in spam, if it take one hour, some it will take four or five hours. It's a waste of it's a small patches. Spam is recommended. Some is not recommended. Some is recommended by ESP upgrades, big upgrades. Like if you want to upgrade whole system. So some is valid, no problem. But spam valid for only want to change two patches or two version patch. Like if you are on SP pack six, you have to go to eight. The spam is recommended. But if you are in ESP four, go to ESP six, some is recommended. But the ESP four to ESP six, it will change your entire stack. All components will going to change. Then spam is not valid. Spam will not work also because if you left left with any one component also. Your update will not complete. But what some does, some will collect all the files by default. You have to give source path and the destination path. What is source? ESP4. What is target? ESP6. Then it will select all the files from ESP4, which are required to go to ESP6 to collect all files, like minimum 900 to 1100 files will collect. We have to keep all those files in our stack file, make general stack ML, and put a path of a stack. It will start upgrade automatically. Errors are bound to come. There are if there are no errors, no basis. Errors will come. You have to just go and read and try to solve all errors. But it will time-consuming thing. But once we're done, then it will take three to four days, five days, or some days, one week also for development systems. So once you're done, then you have to follow same step in quality production. Recently, I have done one ESP upgrade and I have BW upgrade also. So I share you that experience also. But today we're going to see the spam upgrade. What is spam? It is a upgrade your patches. This is a transition code. When an end user of SAP finds a bug in a SAP product, who is end user? Like MM user, like SD user, or FI user, he is going to enter some transaction, enter some PO, PR, any transaction in FI, any transaction in MM, any transaction in SD, any transaction. He find one bug, new bug which he never faced. Okay. First time you use this transaction or the scenario, it found error. Again and again, same error because the error is there. So what he does, you don't know anything. He'll consult as if it's SD error, he'll consult SD lead, SD team lead, SD senior. Then he just go through the error and if he see you, oh, now I require basis help to solve this. What basis will do? Boss basis will do, base will check. If it's possible basis, it basis will do. Otherwise, what basis recommended? Basis will raise a ticket to SAP. Basis will raise a ticket to him saying that key, our SD consultant doing this process. You have to write the process name. We are doing this process. We are on this phase of uh, upgrade. They got to read entire upgrade number like HP 6, 4, 5, 6, SP back 13, 14, everything you right. Then SAP come up. They tell yes, sir, no problem. What they suggest? This feature is disabled in your release. We are agree that. But if you would like to upgrade, you have to upgrade your patch because in a new patch, we will release the solution on this. But your system is still in background. But then two, three steps back you are. So you have to upgrade your system to this level. Once you upgrade, so in that upgrade, we implemented, we rectified this error. So what do you want to do? You have to upgrade system to that level or SAP give you one note, SAP note. We have to implement the note. In that note, what SAP does? SAP giving corrections for this error. Okay? 
SAP is giving correction was error where you have to apply that when you apply this note then I would tell SD people please log in and try again then you'll say key now everything is fine because you have rectified the error in the form of note or in the form of upgrading or support pack these are the two ways to eradicate the normal issues which faced by any functional consultant no special SD no FI any consultant face any issue if you possible for you do it otherwise queue things to SAP they will suggest you the right thing okay because we are paying money to them we need to take support from them always whenever required he reports same product SAP programmers inspect the bug and develop a correction what happened when you send any report to SAP first time then there are code inspectors they will inspect the code they found oh this is not properly written because see SAP is written and is tested for 8 to 10 months but it is being used in 190 countries it is not possible to test all things in two years or one year they will give it to you if any problem comes send SAP they will immediately rectify and give it to you by that that mean only they are going to upgrade system day by day in that portal they are upgrading all these things day by day okay the bug the correction is known as so they will provide you they gave us some note number like this is the, they will give this note number and they write what they write lcc mm inventory config bug example okay the example so next time what happened if some other person some other country having same issues what SAP does they are not going to do code again because they have got crores of one crore two crore notes one lakh two lakh quotes already notes they have if they write mm inventory config bug they will get immediately this note number okay then if second see any in other country also if they try same thing they will get same error because they are on the same version what you do don't do anything you just send this note to them say that key implement this note then your error will goes off what do you tell please implement this note once you implement your error will be goes off then what they do they'll implement and start working if it is completely solved then they will reply you sir after implementing this note our problem is solved okay so like that you have to collect number of notes basis on the basis of errors which are coming day by day whenever sap release any release they always release sp00 i am repeating sp00 support pack 00 after two months you find 01 after four months you find 02 after four months 03 like it's going on increasing how why because from 0 to 0 01 they implement minimum 400 to 500 nodes. They club all nodes and make one support pack. They club thousand nodes from all the countries and club everything in one note. And in that in that 1000 note, any error comes to anybody. SAP have scanners. Oh, this is from this note. Okay, no problem. Then they will tell, please apply this note or please update your support pack from 00 to 01 once we implement 01 all these 500 quotes all these 500 sap nodes or all these 500 corrections bug corrections will automatically implemented into your system automatically but that all else have gone because we implemented from 0 to 01 like that all users are remotely upgraded the system in some other mode okay so this is what so if somebody asks you what is support pack it is a collection of sap notes simple answer it is a collection of support pack is a collection of sap notes only see when they collect 600 notes they made support pack out of that sub p sp12 sp01 like sp02 they have got till sp22 then they change the version directly okay but it will take two years to reach to sp will not like it today and tomorrow they will take every three months there is one one two three one year they'll jump to four or five maximum like that they'll move to 2022 then they change the release only directly 
with time multiple end users report log the same release note sap correct all these corrections in one place and this correction is called support packages the support packages also include enhancement to earlier version of sap like all errors bugs which are come sap solve everything and be ready for all solution 24/7 throughout the world you know we have seven centers of sap throughout the world seven big centers like in india we have only one center in bengaluru anything happening you just call bengaluru number after that we have one in next to india we have one in singapore and main thing we have one in germany like it, and the other one is your uh, in europe okay like that and australia they set up seven big centers in each center minimum 5 to 6000 people are working to solve this all issues in our case in india what happened first our case go to bengaluru if bengaluru people are not able to solve then they escalate this to singapore first and second then to german any country like singapore first issue the first singapore will see the issue then they'll see nearer to singapore like us is nearer they go to us not able to then third is germany first is your place second is nearest place third is german but your issue should be solved within a given period of time if it is a production issue if it is quality development it may take more time but production no time they will answer immediately in simple words collection of sap notes is called as a support packages okay see so sap notes I, I, this is not, not real numbers i just give examples but the, those numbers are something like this only okay see sap note for st22 term they collect 500 to 1000 notes then they convert sp1 please upgrade your self to sp1 sp2 sp3 sp4 esp8 See, ESP8, we have support pack till 21. Okay, you just imagine for one support pack, they use 600, 700 nodes. So how many nodes they have been implemented to support pack 21? One, once when, when user jump from ESP7 to ESP8 support pack 21, so what happened? All these patches, nodes, all comes together with the support pack upgrade. Or ESP upgrade itself. That is the reason why most of the European companies they'll do upgrade three times a year, four times. Small, small upgrade. See, if you wait for four years, it's a big upgrade for you. But if you do it in small, small cycle, like um, SAP is new patch, just upgrade it three months back, three months before, three months back, three months. Like you continuously upgrade the system. So by that, when you want to do enhancement upgrade, also it will take very lesser time. Otherwise. You make a junk of a files, all errors in your system. Then you try to upgrade. It's a time consuming and money consuming also. Because for doing upgrades, there are different teams who do only upgrades of systems. They'll charge huge amount of money from you, okay? For doing nothing. What is patch? What is patch? Patch is bundle of SAP nodes. What is patch? What is support pack? It's a bundle. Bundle means more than one. It may be 10, it may be 100, it may be 1000. It's a bundle of SAP nodes. Now see, prerequisites while implementing SP, where SP stands for support packages. SP stands for support packages. Always implement this note in client triple zero. This you should write somewhere, okay? If you try, if you are a business consultant, you join a company and company said, please implement note and you log into 100 implementing a note, they will kick you off. Okay, you have to be very careful because if you do small mistake, you lost your whole system here. You lost whole system, but but we have we have to take some precautions like before doing any upgrade, before doing any patch upgrade, you have to take OS backup, you have to take database backup, you have to take your system backup as on date with offline backup by which if a system hampering, shutdown goes, is totally corrupted, crashed, no issues. You are offline backup will work for you. 
just restore your backup your system is ready your system is ready so what are the prerequisites as a basis consultant nobody will tell you what to do prerequisite they will give a ticket to solve you have to take all immediate steps the first time ask your friend ask a google ask your seniors no problem no hesitation in asking if you feel if i ask he thinking something no you think whatever you you may think it, but if you lost system means it will embarrass your career okay then if you do some wrong thing in a company then they are, will never give you any good activity they will always give you small small activities baba you do this only because you already tampered with system for us okay so you have to be very careful if you don't know ask nobody will ask but write it down second time don't ask first time if you have any issues ask they will help you out so this is one mandatory thing triple zero client one mandatory thing then second you have to back up see very important if somebody tell are development kar dena kuch nahi hota hai no don't do if anybody says it's very urgent no sir i will not do please do it yourself if you want but we will follow our steps we have to take ha ah, if it is in aws nowadays you see out of 10 customers nine are on aws out of 10 customers nine you will find in i also work with aws all my whole landscape sits sit like aws only aws means offline backup also and ami backup also a m i a stands for aid amazon m stands for machine i stands for image amazon machine image okay you have to take that also amazon machine image and offline backup then only go for upgrade otherwise leave it system as it is no worry one day one month also don't do without backup and without approvals and see you need to take prior approvals downtime to test all the scenarios because upgrade means what take and time consuming thing you think it will done in 4 hours but it will take one day two day also if you are a fresher in experienced or sometimes if error comes even expert also try for two days for doing small small upgrade sometimes ha huh. development will take time but quality production you know that what we have done error comes they are bound to come but what we have done in development write it down somewhere quality same issue come because your development quality production or on same level from day one whatever things you do in development write it down in proper points ha it is error comes i done this error comes i done this this error comes i like that you have to write everything quality before error comes ready with solution now you know this error will come i don't need to do this i it means what for product development it takes 5 days for quality it will take only 2 days jump into production it will take one day only okay so this is the cycle you have to follow see write down this thing before upgrade you have to upgrade your spam level before upgrade you have to upgrade your spam level what is spam level for each system spam level is there and each new spam level is come now with the latest spam is 72 latest spam is 72 for netvio 7.3 if you have, there are many companies who still work on 7.3 only because if they want to go to 7.5 they need to invest one more crore for upgrade data this that they are happy with 7.3 only no worry so you have done last upgrade in 2016 i'll imagine we'll do the imagination we have done last upgrade in 2016 no issues then today is 2022 now you decided to do the upgrade so you have to do many steps you have to see the kernel level in 2016 what is the level see what all releases come in between you have to take note all those things okay igs servers graphic servers all things you have to take care what was there in 2016 and what is there in 2022 like here you have to take all those things and spam also 
in 2016, it may be at 34, 35. Now it is 72. But if you forget and start a braid, nothing, nobody will stop. A braid also start with 38 only. But what happened? When new balanese comes, it is not compilable 38. It is not compiled 38, and your upgrade goes into an error. Upgrade goes into error because of these silly mistakes. You have to restore system this is that. So before doing, see all prerequisite steps very immediately. Spam is 73. Don't go to 73. Go to minimum 70. Go to 71. Nobody asks for 73. Why is it recommend? You have to be always n minus one. 74 is released. They are on 73, but they we also have to win 72, 73. Okay. Otherwise, otherwise, what happened? If you go to latest level, you will find error every day because in latest level, SAP people are working for six to seven months and make it error free. So. What is the suggestion of all companies? Never go to n minus n n thing. A development you go to n. Otherwise, you go to n minus one only. In n minus one, all patches are implemented already. You just want to implement that node only. Okay. In that node, minimum five six hundred nodes have been already implemented. If you go to that level directly, see. Before upgrade, before upgrade, you need to update kernel also as per SAP recommendation. Like see, you did last April 2017 kernel also. Now it's 2021 ending or 2022. If you try to upgrade a system, kernel what they have? They have files of 2016-17. Now SAP some, SAP has 2022. Some Something will match and compile, but some objects are not compiling because the code, this code, the programming, everything is different. 2622. So at that time, you have to be very careful. You have to be very careful before you need to update your kernel. The latest pack, see, 753 is the latest kernel. 7, 7.4, 7.42, 7.43, 7.45, 7.49. Now they have come up with 7.53 as the latest kernel level. You have to match. If it is 7.53 goes with you, just go in 7.6, 7.49, 45. They have got 100, 200, 300, 400, 800, 900, 1000 patches per kernel. Then they jump on to the next level. So you need to upgrade a kernel as well to ensure that there is enough space. See, this is the magic. If you blind, if you don't follow notes and blindly jump to upgrade, you come back after two years saying that key, it shows file system error. We don't have space to save the records. It's embarrassing things for management. If somebody tells the basis this the mistake, then they will keep the delta the key. You have no idea how to do the patch upgrade. So before that, go to some Google notes, go to my notes, my videos, ask your friends also. And take all steps. Take one, two day, no problem. Take three days also preparing all these things. But when you start, start in perfect manner. We should complete. See, I gave here USR recipe recipe trans. Okay, especially USR recipe recipe trans has to be have 50 GB space before starting. 50 GB space because it is going to write all archive log files. Ha, we made stop archive logs also. I'll tell all things what we can do what we cannot do what is possible and what is not possible either you increase a space of 50 gb where usr sap trans okay after that once 50 gb space is clear then you are whatever upgrade you want to do you do upgrade that will bundle in the 50 gb only if you have only so 500 mb left 7 MB left, Rover go for upgrade. Tell in front team, increase the space. They will increase, they only start. Otherwise, in between, it will hamper your system. Very important path, USR SAP trans for upgrading activities. The new transaction code spam for upgrade of patches. See, we discussed about spam, spam. What is spam, why spam? You have to use spam only 
to upgrade your patches. Okay, Saint. We have one more decode called Saint for add-on installations. We have got one more decode Saint for add-on installations. Okay, we'll do. We'll see that also. The support package stack is list of available Java support for all software components. Okay, NetWeaver, it is bring each software component SAP NetWeaver defined in a SAP support pack level. So what happened? If you think to upgrade from NetWeaver 7.3 support pack 10 to support pack 15, so what happened here? There are some tools. Well, we are learning of tools also. Okay, there's a tool called maintenance planner. There's a tool called maintenance optimizer. What they do? They will generate from source to target what all you also don't know what files require. I also don't know, nobody knows, but SAP knows very well what file has to be taken and what file needs to be updated while doing this patch update activities. I am talking about big updates. Huh? If it is one to patch update, nothing will. If you want to do like from 10, 10 to 22, if you want to go, but 10, 11, 12, 20, 13, 14, 15, 16, like 22, this may end up a bigger. If you want to go from four to five, no issues. It'll take hardly one hour. Everything is done. Depending upon requirement, you have to take decisions how to, how easy you go with the upgradation. Support packages commonly known as a stack bundle. All required component will patches are already tested together and recommended to applying SPS instead of individual until unless you have same problem with require certain component to patch it. Here, same thing. Whenever you find anything you raise to SAP, what SAP said, oh, the same trend we have in German also. Because SAP has 190 countries. What hardware you have, the same hardware you will find hundreds of places, but you never know that. But SAP knows he this hardware matches to the US client. We'll see what they have done. They immediately log the system and check what is the support product level. Then suggest you key, Baba, this is the solution we have, and the solution works for this customer also. You have to use these steps. You can follow that kind also. Okay. See, this is the older path. This is the older path of supporting searching support pack and all. I show you the new path from where you can search support packs very easily. This is the old path. If you want to learn, learn, but it is a old path, a total old path. Now see, each software component a specific sequence of support packet. The following list contains C SAP APPL. This is the component. Okay, support pack. SAP basis, SAP ABAP. SAP SCM, SAP HR, SAP BW, SAP CRM. These all are support packages. Okay, so you can do any support packages. So this is the main thing. SAP APL means it shows you your, it shows you the version of your existing SAP. If somebody asks you version, you have to check your SAP APPL. which gives you the exact position of your support pack or release, release also support pack also, okay? So you see one more thing, we have 27 steps to upgrade your support pack. Not like you take and come and go, no, nobody will ask. Here, we have 27 steps to follow. Then you can say I have done the upgrade. It may take one hour also, it may take one day also, it may take seven weeks also. But once you start, you have to complete, complete in within given frame of time. Okay. Now I'll do one thing. I'll jump onto system and show you how it works.
see what I have done. I am logging to triple zero client with DDS user and the password. Okay, never share DDS user password to never share user password to any users. Okay. Okay, now you will see one by one what all this we can able to see. Okay. In this server, we don't have reports, data, anything to check. So nothing is active. Nothing is active over here. Okay. See, nothing is active. Okay. Because this is a dummy system, but if you go to live system, you get a much more data over there. You get a much more data over there. Load from application server to front end. This you will do. What I've done, I've just uh, fired the command SPAM spam. If you take more time, kill the process and start again. See here, wherever you go, before doing support pack, you have to, you have to give this license you have to install. But even in our case, we are not able to install a license because SAP is installed with the systems which are registered with SAP. They will send you certificates, all everything. But the, the system which I installed is not related to SAP. It's our own system. So if you want registered, nobody will take your registration and let us pay huge amount of money. Okay. See spam version 39. Spam version is 39. Now if you check the current spam version, it may be some exhausting number. See, I'll show you. One minute. Okay. 
see this is a portal you need to know all the shortcuts from where to get everything see tools software maintenance remember the tools and software maintenance where you get all your tools you find more of our tools over here see payment spam update what is this from see update from seven to this is the latest for 756 from 7 to 756 so we are in which version check your version 730 39 so what is the latest you just find from here See 730. We are on 730. What is the latest patch? 79. See 79. We are on. See our number is not here only. Okay. So the, the, see the dates 21, 21, 21, 3, 20, 23, 19, 19, 19, 19 the yearly. They give three updates to you for spam. Okay, nearly three updates yearly. They will provide you for spam. They should do updates after a few years. You have to be very careful. Otherwise, your upgrade will start. Nobody, nobody will stop. But because of this, it will become a big disaster. But we cannot able to recover system also because those these old binaries. And your new binaries will not match it, not able to compile things properly. If it is a new with the new binaries, it will compile things and upgrade will go successfully. The first most step, we have to upgrade this very carefully. You have to upgrade this, this very carefully. Now you see. First, you have to go to support packages, load packages from front end. From the two, two options we have from application server, that's from front end. Type first on application server. Now you see this is the path, this is your main path. See properly, write it down somewhere. The path we have the big history out of that, just write it down somewhere. See, this is the path USR SAP trans EPS in here. You are total files stored here. Which files? All patches which you are downloaded from marketplace. You have to keep here only where trans EPS in. Okay. If if you found anything in EPS in, please delete it or rename it. What we are doing? We are renaming in with in old. Then create one in folder and keep a new files over there. Then those will those will those files will update from here directly. Those are the tactics. I'll tell you how to work with those kinds of thing. Okay. So till now we studied how to load how to upload the things now we will see how to upgrade the patches after once files loaded into eps in folder okay if i press s what happened see no ocs files are found because here nothing is there because we haven't keep anything in eps in if i keep anything in eps in it will go here and and one more thing we do not have license it will fail there also key okay? you you are not able you don't have license so it will go it will not go further so what to do in those cases 
See OCS, if nothing is the OCS is empty. Okay. Then it will show you the source and destination path for upgrade. Next step, it will show you the source and source and uh, target path. Like from support pack 00, 0 to support pack 5, we have to update to this support pack 5. Then it will start importing. Then you check logs 1. Logs 1 went fine. Every you confirm the QR. Like okay, what happened? From support pack 00, 0 support pack 5, you have to. You have to go from support pack 00 to support pack 5. First, you have to download all things from 00 to 05. Like, see, I'll show you. Step to update support package, download support packages. See here what we have done. We are upgrading our spam level from 74056 to 77. 74077. Later by 77, we made it to 77. But this is a, this is upgrade of spam from 56 to 77. If you want to see what is latest in latest in 740, go and check 740 with 740. So 77 was previously, but the 21 only February. Now they are on 79. Mother, two, three patches backward, no problem. It is later 79, you are on 75, no problem. Later 79, you are at 25, pretty means it is not acceptable at all. Okay? It will be not acceptable at all. Be careful. Now, where to get all those things? Go to installations, support packages. There you will find all those things one by one. See here, I'll go here. Downloads. Is there any other portal or any other site is available for this support package? package. Ademra? No, no, no. No. Only one thing? No. Only a three portal. Okay. Netweaver. See Netweaver. Netweaver. 7.5, for example. Latest. They will go always latest only. So here, you have to choose. Applicant server ABAP system you are installing. Go to ABAP. Very good. Then, in ABAP, all these components we have see ABAP basis BW. Write it down somewhere. Whenever you up this, this is called a NetWeaver stack. Whenever somebody tell to upgrade a NetWeaver stack, at that time what we need to do? We need to upgrade NetWeaver stack like this. I'll show you. System status. See, ABAP basis, PI basis, BW. These are the four components of your NetWeaver. If you upgrade this, then you have to upgrade this, this, this two to save. 
this all should be in same level otherwise your system will not work properly any business consultant new beginner also fresher also topmost also you should know this thing key whenever you upgrade your net your stack you have to upgrade the abap basis pi basis sap bw and now they have added two three more functionality like sap fnd like sap foundation and sap you also they added but it is a previous versions okay stick to this whenever somebody asks if abap is 730 from 00 then have to download 05 for this also this also and this also okay now you will see how to download those things sabap so basis bw pi you will find somewhere over here okay now you go click here this 7.5 na uh, 7.5 okay see here these are the patches like for example you are on support pack 9 you are on support pack 9 then company tell to our we need to go to 14 or the tell from 9 to 14 so what you have to do you have to download 10 you have to download 11 you have to download 12 13 14 which components components are same abap basis abap basis bw basis see pi is not look come here in 7.5 they removed pi okay but if you go 7.3 7.4 you will find abap basis b pi and B, uh, bw you have to for all for this also for this also see everything all same release you have to download sheet 22 you are on 9 9 we have to move to 14 you have to download all these the so way to keep after downloading what to do with this what after down see these are download patches the all these things see these are the we did this up against server front end okay then from application server support then what to do download support packet from marketplace and keep them at os level os level means somewhere here this is my os level this is my os level make one folder a b c keep everything over there okay then uncard them see you have to uncard them the most of the times you have to keep everything in usr acp trans and uncard them fire the command uncard once you fire the command uncard everything will get everything get extracted and go sit here this is the logic see you have to remember this again and again from usr acp trans when you fire this command acp car iphone xvf and support pack name or you use star over here star dot star what it will do it will copy extract everything and copy here directly see we are in we are in trans you can able to see usr acp trans i fired command acp car iphone xpf dot car then where it goes it goes to eps scene can you able to see it go to eps scene and create two files for each thing att pat att files and pat files for one one support pack it will create one att one ppt one att one pat okay you have to remember those things but what you you have to know all paths you have to know all these paths by heartly totally anybody will ask any time you should know all these things how to fire see here we have fired on show you sap car iphone xpf this is your pass number okay where it will extract it will extract in eps in folder but we fire this from usr sap trans only as discussed okay see after upgrading support pack os level it will create it will create pat files stored at eps in directory see 
EPS in rate three. But here we don't have anything because we don't have those files. I'll show you the things I would require looks. Now the main thing comes over here. Once you confirm the queue, it will move. See, when you're doing upgrades in OS level, Linux is very tough to do upgrades because no GUI screen, nothing. You have to sit for one, two, three, four hours. We don't know whether upgrade is going on or not. If it is going on, where to check the logs, many nobody knows. But I'll tell you where to check the logs. You have to check logs in temp folder. Where is the temp folder? See, I'll show you the temp folder. Say we have temp folder. Whenever you are, whenever you are, whenever and wherever, any landscape, small or big, when a bread goes and bread is running, the log written in temporary thing. Because once you change your mind, I don't want to upgrade, cancel it to temporary folder, disappear accordingly, and your system is as like as before. Okay? But it means what? It will not upgrade real system. It will upgrade in virtual things. Like temp folder, it upgrade all the logs till end. So till end, it asks for confirmation whether you would like to upgrade prop things or not accept. If you accept, then this all logs, this all logs goes and saves at this location. Which location? Now location changes. Once you confirm, this is the location. Once you confirm, things will come here. Okay? This is done. This is done. This is the APSN we have seen. This is all components. See, all components have to kick. Then you will show you the source path and target path. Matlab, ABAP from where to where you go, basis from where to where you go. It should support pack level 0506, 0506. When you press calculate Q, when you press calculate Q, then it will go forward. If it is not calculating means here, there is a missing file. You have to get that file immediately. If it calculate, it goes further, well and fine. If it won't go, it shows you red mark over it, saying that key basis, like for example, you have to download from nine to 14. You download from 9 to 14 all, one in one component to download all but forgot 13. At that time, this issue comes. But it will not match, it will stop. Then go and search again and get the 13, add here and start doing things, okay? Then here, the upgrade starts. Then after that, you have to define the queue. After that, you have to define the queue. Where to define queue? From here, see? So display defined. All components. Check on all components. It'll show you this. Once I calculate this, it should go further. Is it, all should come is equal to is equal to nothing come greater than less than. Same, same, same. Yes, everything is same. So it's come like this. But real time, you will get some patches here, same patches here, same patches here, same patches here. Okay, then you have to click this. Then import queue. If it's not empty, the queue runs started. Then here the real, real step starts. When you define this import queue, then your system is starting importing things one by one, one by one. Okay, it has to cross all 26, 27 steps. So like this support track five then at last we have to confirm the queue confirm the queue means what it will show here everything is fine go here then confirm if you confirm this once you click on confirm immediately 
everything from temporary folder move it to log file within fraction of seconds matlab your update successfully completed and this will become like this previously it was hello mark when you confirm this queue it will go and make like this means you have done your implementation in perfect manner see previously it is like this you see here showing hello mark over here hello mark okay once i confirm the queue confirm the queue so it will show everything working fine but here there are some few steps okay there are few steps you have to follow but till 30 you can go back any time till 13th step 12th step once you start 13th step there is no go you have to go further only no back because here your real system started upgrading with old old system will get updated with the new files if you upgrade to three four then your system is not will not work properly because half of our new half of our new bold so in 12 step only you have to decide whether go further or not if everything goes fine go as if you want to quit quit temp folder can temp folder will delete automatically your system work normally and you can take some other downtime to this activity okay this step number 30 is very important and that is a import of import queue all import abap dumps abap abap system is upgrading things from old to new in 13th step then confirm queue once you confirm queue means you have confirming key uh, everything is fine now you go ahead then it will transfer all things from temp to main log the status becomes like this okay then if you want to check the queue okay, how my things are going or if you want to check queue in between when i'm stuck go and see here it will show but things are going or not or go to temp folder and press dir it is going to write every hour one one line two hours one line matlab you you come to know ki my system is upgrading is not stopping takes time but it will doing okay then if you want to do if you want to check any logs you have to go to action logs see this action log very important import logs action logs all this you should know where to check and when to check if error persists in area see while while support was updated logs are made in temporary directory us are recipe trans tmp once import process completed log can be viewed from the log path this is this log path once import is done completely we accept the things okay then you can able to see this thing from log file also so this is what i would like to make you understand on patch administration patch update okay so one minute